Hello to everyone, Denise Kozar here. In this video I want to show you how to work with Corona Distance Map and Corona Scatter. How to use them together for creating some interesting things. So in this case I have Terrain and Corona Scatter. To show you how Corona Distance Map work I will use simple Corona material. I will create it from scratch. So we have base material, assign it to my object. Next, I want to add Corona distance map. So here I plug it into diffuse color and nothing happens. I need to create some object with this spline or it can be another object and current distance will be work. So I have line, I will create it smooth and I added here to current um, distance node input. So if we render now, we can see the difference. Now it looks that the we have black spline. I will change distance far see it more clearly maybe 5000 and um, here we are we have some map but it worked only in some places so if I want to create mask along all this plane I need to have a um, 3D geometry not 2D because current distance work with um, 3D objects not just projected on the plane so I just add extrude next I go to object properties make it unrenderable and display box so now I have nice spline along my plane and we will use this mask maybe something larger to plug it into the corona scatter and here I want to show you some additional info uh, we, we have gradient here because corona distance work as a falloff map and we can change the uh, value of uh, this gradient by color map so it can be like this and uh, here we have sharp line and something like this how it will be used I will show later and um, now when you saw how it works let's enable corona scatter and see how it works to make my path I need to plug it 
Corona distance map to my X scale axis. I also can uh, plug it into density, but uh, with uh, scale it work more realistic. So I make output as a shortcut and um, plug it into X axis. And now you can see here I have my path and um, as I said later or previously you can um, adjust the scale of the grass to make it um, with different pattern enable color map and now as you can see we have more sharp gradient to from little grass to very high or tall grass and um, if you wish the grass grow um, much more intensive and um, a bigger scale near the middle of the road so you change this map like this and um, here we are it much more taller to the middle and I need to make this distance larger I also change the value here to make it more easy to see the difference and um, now let's look how it works with um, the clothes shapes maybe something like circle so I will turn current scatter off so you can see the principle and turn on this material and now let's clear this object here and add some maybe circle and place it here so like in the previous way I just create extrude next we will start interactive plug this circle here and um, make it display box and uncheck renderable okay now we have this pattern and we can check this and um, make mask to look like this so our grass will not grow here in the next video I show you how to combine these two paths into one and um, we will look some more interesting things you can do the with corona distance map corona scatter and other so subscribe and uh, stay to the next interesting videos
write some comments about your maybe topics you wish to see on my channel and I will create some interesting videos about it like this video it will motivate me for recording new videos and uh, see you next time bye